How's that tail burn? Listen, if anybody in this family gets hurt, I'm holding you personally responsible. They're having a good time. I'll take responsibility for that. Hey, Bruno, I took a few clippings out of my quills to do a little comparison. Look at this. The grass seems to be greener over here. Bernie, are you certain you came to the same place? Yeah, because you know the raccoon says... Uh, okay, enough about him. I get it. So we can do a couple of tricks. I mean, it's not like he can walk on water. Hey, everybody, this way to the food. Well, I could be wrong. What is that? That is an SUV. Humans ride around in it because they are slowly losing their ability to walk. Gee, but it's so big. How many humans fit in there? Usually, one. Ooh. Hi, this is Gladys Sharp. Your president of the Homeowners Association? Right. Oh, what? what is that? Easy, easy, don't worry. That's just a human being, and they are just as scared of us as we are of them. Now, if a human does happen to see you, just lay down, roll over, and give your privates a good licking. They love it. The homeowner's charter, which you signed, says the grass is supposed to be two inches, and according to my measuring stick, yours is 2.5. Did we just get the food and go? Really? Do they have it or not? Let me see. It was in the box. They've always got food with them. We eat to live. These guys live to eat. Let me show you what I'm talking about. The human mouth is called a pie hole. The human being is called a couch potato. That is the device to summon food. That is one of the many voices of food. That is the portal for the passing of the food. That is one of the many food transportation vehicles. Humans bring the food, take the food, ship the food, they drive the food, they wear the food. That gets the food hot. That keeps the food cold. That, I'm not sure what that is. Ah! Ah! What do you know? Food! That is the altar where they worship food. That's what they eat when they've eaten too much food. That gets rid of the guilt so they can eat more food. Food! 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 Well, they don't. For humans, enough is never enough. <gasps> and what do they do with the stuff they don't eat? They put it in gleaming silver cans just for us. Dig in! Okay, dig out of this trash can. Good, isn't it? does come out of a wazoo. Sorry. So, what do you think? Was I right or was I right? And these things are just the scrap. Where do you see what comes in the boxes, and the packages, and the cans? I'm telling you, folks, you stick with me. And in one week, we will gather enough food to, 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 to feed a bear. Huh? Just figure speed. Check back with you. 